love you guys. Happy 2023. What's up you guys? Welcome back to my YouTube channel. In today's video, I thought I'd film a little haul of my recent purchases from Sephora and Ulta. Now, I mainly just picked up a lot of like skincare and makeup items, so let's just get started. The first item that I went and picked up from Sephora yesterday was something that I've been eyeing for so long, you guys. Like I legit saw a video of Pia Mia talking about this product and how it's helped her skin and I was like, I have to get this, you guys. And I went in Sephora actually probably two times in a row. Um, and they didn't have it available in the store. It was only online. And I just, I don't know. Sometimes I just don't want to order things. I'd rather just pick it up in person. And also I can film it for you guys. So, okay, guys. So the first item here is the Drunk Elephant Bouncy Bright Facial Mask Illuminator. Um, this is supposed to correct and clarify your skin. And it has so many cool things in here that I'm so excited to try. It has 10% Alicylic Acid. 1% salicylic acid and a triple antioxidant brightening complex which I definitely need right now um, not even just like my dark spots just in all areas of my face could use like a roundabout of like brightening and just like looking more healthy and nourished so I'm so excited to try this I actually haven't even opened it yet so let's just open it together I wanted to try it last night but I was like you know what? I'm just gonna wait till I film this haul for you guys oh my god look at you guys it's so cool I love it love 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 um so it's just like a face mask and you can do this i think once or twice a week i don't really know i think it's like a twist or like a pump but i'm gonna try to open it it doesn't really have a smell to it you guys it smells like a moisturizer and it also kind of smells like brightening products if that makes sense but it's pretty cool i'm excited i can't wait to use this tonight um so 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 excited to try this I'm gonna put the protector back on it just in case it like pumps out by accident. I love that they have that as well. The next product that I picked up here is also from Drunk Elephant. Um, this is like a little set. It's their um, dream day set and it's so cool you guys. It comes with all these mini products. Um, so it comes with the Sea Firm Refresh Day Serum which is supposed to firm and brighten and it says it has 15% um, of this acid, I don't know how to pronounce, but it has that and it also has the liquid serum base I actually saw a tiktok video on it and it comes with two parts and it's like one is a powder and one is a liquid And you basically put it in one and you mix it up very well and then you can use it like a serum Which I thought was cool Um, and then I also have the bee hydra intensive hydration serum, which I've heard really good things about this hydration Serum, so I'm excited to test these out um yeah, let's open this. This is really cute. I like the packaging. I feel like I saw this in Ulta when I was like shopping after Christmas with my gift card, but I can't remember what it looked like. But Okay, so literally you just take it out like that, and I think there should be an opening somewhere. Let's see how this works. I don't know. I don't want to like mess it up because I also want to film like a TikTok on it, but I'm just going to like take the pieces out and show you. So this is the serum base. I really hope that focused for you guys, but it's like this pump applicator and this has a little bit of the liquid in it. And I think you would just like open it from here. Oh, this is the powder, you guys. Wow. Okay, so it's powder at the bottom. And then this one, this is the actual liquid, I can hear it, but that's like the liquid part of the serum and you literally would pour they don't smell like anything I don't know why I keep smelling them but you literally would just pour the liquid in here and then you would shake it well together and then you use the pump to get the serum out but I think that's so cool and the last thing we have here is the hydration serum this is all put together you guys I think it's just the brightening one that has a two dual set um but this one is just like a regular serum with hydration everything's already in here so literally you just would like pump it out and i can't wait to use this as well tonight i'm so excited to test all these products out hopefully they help clear my skin or i see like a big difference over time i know it's going to take like a few weeks for me to see anything but i'm excited 
Okay, you guys, and since I was on like a drunk elephant kick in Stephora for some reason, I picked up another product from them, but this is more like lip care. I actually wanted this the last time that I saw, but I'm like, no, I'm going to wait until they have the actual brightening mask in, and I could pick it all up together, so I'm happy that I found this there. The first time I went in Sephora, they didn't have it, but I went again in the same day, and they restocked, so I was happy about that. This is called the Lippy Balm, and it's supposed to smooth and rescue your lips when they're chapped and i think this is perfect in this season and also like i've had this summer fridays lip butter balm for so long i'm going to test out another product now although i still love my summer fridays um i think this would be good to just leave on one of my bags or like on my nightstand at night like if i need to like re-moisturize my lips i feel like this is perfect little lip balm look at how cute this is you guys tell me this is not the cutest like mini lip balm ever you guys know i'm obsessed with mini products but i wanted to test this out on this video but since i already like have some lip gloss on i'm gonna wait but it's literally like a twist it reminds me of those aqua four ones that everyone's like talking about which i have but i lost one so this again doesn't smell like anything but i just think all these products are like non-scented which i love um but yeah i'm so excited to test this out you guys and wear it at night like I'm literally going to be putting this all over my lips all the time now that I have this. Okay, you guys, so the next thing that I picked up was not from Stephora or Ulta. This was actually from Macy's MAC because Stephora didn't have this one makeup product that I was looking for. It's a white gel eyeliner, and I'm fairly new to the eyeliner makeup product, so I really like the gel. I feel like it works well for me, and I like how smudged it looks when I apply it. So this is called the MAC Color Access gel pencil eyeliner um and it's one of those like twistable applicators think of like um an eyebrow pencil where you twist it up and it's like a gel form so i love that when i went in there they actually didn't have it available but the lady checked in the back for me and they had it and i'm so happy that they did look at this packaging you guys this is so cute it gives me really nostalgic vibes. I swear, I used to love the NC45 um, powder foundation from MAC. When I was in like high school, that's literally the only makeup product that I owned was that. And I would just apply it on my face every day. Either like first period class, like I would run to the bathroom before class or I'd do it like if I had time, getting ready for school in the morning before I got dropped off. But ugh, I'm so happy they have this, you guys. And I'll show you it. So I just used it today, and of course, when I opened it, I like ripped a little bit of it off. So I'm pretty sad about that. I actually don't know why it was like already there. I feel like the product shouldn't have been so high up for it to break like that, but it's fine. It was me. Um, but it looks like this. It already has my makeup on it, you guys. I'll try to twist it up more so you can see the actual white in it. Of course, it has like my concealer and my black mascara on it, but you guys can get the gist of the white eyeliner and it's so cool you guys i'm obsessed i'll do a little swatch for you it's literally like a gel gel eyeliner and i have a pencil one you guys but the thing is oh my god i just keep getting it everywhere but i don't like the pencil it's very hard for me to use and also like it's been scratching my eye so i don't use it but you guys, I'm so obsessed with this product. I'm like highly, highly, highly in love with it. Um, I've been wanting a white eyeliner for so long, you guys. And I've been like dreaming about it and like doing TikTok videos. Of, like makeup get ready with me. It's like applying a white eyeliner and how cool it would look on me. And I finally have it. So I'm excited. This is definitely going to be like in my monthly favorites for this month. And yeah, I love it. Definitely will repurchase more of these from MAC. If Sephora is ever out of like their gel eyeliners. But... If you ever wanted to know, Macy's has a MAC. And I don't know why the packaging is silver because it's literally white, but it's fine. So you guys, this is the Ulta bag that I have on hand. I promise you I didn't do a lot of damage in here. It's literally three items, but I couldn't find a smaller bag. So we're using this one for the aesthetic of it. Um, but the first product that I picked up was this Olaplex bonding oil which is number seven and i love this you guys i've been using this for over a year now and it's absolutely my favorite it's probably my fourth repurchase of olaplex hair oil i'm not kidding you guys and i keep repurchasing them because i just like the way it makes my hair feels so i love the smell to it i love how lightweight it is but it does its job um, i've kind of been drenching my hair in oil for the past few days and it doesn't really look that good because i feel like I have some split ends now so I probably need a trim so as much as I try to like tame them and like you know make them all slick down with oil it just like kind of sticks out I feel like trimming it myself but I'm gonna wait till I go to the hair salon and 
let it be professionally done so i'm excited also like one side of my hair looks a lot straighter than the other like this side looks more frizzy and like split ends and then this side looks more like silk and like straight you know what i mean like it still has that like nice flowy bounce and then this side is just like i don't like this side but um yeah i'm gonna make a hair appointment soon and we'll get that fixed but this is how much i've used so far you guys i probably got this December 26th, you guys. That's the day after Christmas, and that's how much I've used so far. I feel like I'm kind of going overboard, but, like, since my hair hasn't been, like, a hair mask, or, like, you know, I haven't gotten it done, I have just been hoping that this Olaplex oil will save me, and it has been saving me, but I don't know, you guys, but, yeah, I love this. I'll repurchase another one very soon. I know I'm going to need one sooner than later. I also want to try like some white products, but I'll talk about that at the end of the video. Okay, you guys, so I picked up some skincare from Ulta as well. So this is the Fresh Skincare Prep Essentials. So it comes with the Soy Face Cleanser and the Rose Deep Hydration Facial Toner. You guys, I'm obsessed with this brand and they have the best cleanser ever. It's so refreshing, so hydrating, so lightweight, and it smells like cucumbers. So I love that. Um, but I thought I could test this out as well on my skin. Just like some clean products that's just legit like a cleanser, which is my favorite of all time. You guys, I am happy I made this purchase because one, I love this face cleanser. And also I don't have a toner, so I thought this would be great to use for deep hydration. Although I have combination oily and dry skin, there are certain areas of my skin that are just super dry and like they flake, which is mainly like my nose area. Like it'll start peeling my skin will start peeling there and i don't like the way that looks especially when i'm wearing makeup it just doesn't look better so hopefully this helps that that's the main reason why i picked up this toner and i'm excited to test this out the last thing that i picked up from alta is kylie cosmetics and i've never had any of her products before so i'm like super excited to test this out but it's basically her mini bronze eyeshadow palette and i don't know how to use eyeshadow so i thought this would be like very daring of me to get into try but also i'm pretty creative so i'll probably just like wind up doing other things with this um i love the color scheme there's so many cool colors and yeah i just like it if i can get it open i'll show you guys what's in it okay Ooh, look at this you guys it's so cool i love that i'm obsessed with makeup you guys like honestly okay this is so cute you guys um so that's the bottom and it has this little mirror but i don't want you guys to see my reflection because my setup right now looks a little insane but it comes with all these pretty bronze colors it has like a vanilla an unmatched a bronze up one She's golden, which looks really good. A mocha latte and a brunette. Ugh, a mocha latte, you guys. I don't really like mocha in my lattes, but that kind of sounds pretty cool. And I love it, you guys. It's so cute. I really wanted to get one of her lip kits, but I didn't like the shades they had at Ulta. And I didn't feel like testing a bunch out and like just driving myself insane trying to find a shade. So I was like, I'm going to try something new with makeup. I'm going to try something different that I don't have. Because you guys know I recently got an advent calendar. From benefit and i test out all those makeup products and i love them all and i was like kind of have double of what i already have so i wanted to go a different route and pick up an eyeshadow palette um so i'm excited to use this you guys and yeah the next makeup product i think i want to get is like a highlighter but i don't know what brand i want to be into maybe like a rare beauty highlighter because i don't have any rare beauty makeup products so Okay, you guys, so I also want to show you what's in my cart and stuff for right now. So the first thing that I have in here is the Way Matte Pomade, and I feel like it's a good styling product that I don't have right now. Like, I mainly just have, like, shampoos, conditioners, purple shampoos, um, hair oil. I don't really have these kind of products, so I want to test these out. I also really love that their products can be tested out on your hair if it's bleached or, like, colored, so we love that. I also want to test out the Way Detangling and Frizz Frightening Leave-In Conditioner. Um, I think this would just be good to have. I feel like I have one from Dry Bar, but it's like very miniature that I feel like I don't have enough to do my whole head. So obviously I want to get another leave-in conditioner. Also just more moisture in my hair, especially because it's like bleached and in this season it's super dry and yeah. The next thing that I want to pick up is the Way Hair Oil. I actually smelled this in Sephora and it smells so good and natural. It smells like flowers to me and I love this. I think I'm going to wait to purchase this one until I'm a little bit low on my Olaplex hair oil and then I might switch over to this one. 
so i'm super excited to test this one out also this one is a pump which olaplex hair oil is not a pump so i'm excited the next thing that i want to test out is their super dry shampoo i used to love dry shampoo you guys when i tell you dry shampoo is me like literally my hair wouldn't even need any and i would just be like oh i just need it to smell a little better or give it some more volume even though it's not what dry shampoo is for i literally would just spray my roots with it and like tease it in and i'd be like okay i'm ready to leave out the door my hair is going to smell really good so those are all the next like hair product things that i'm going to be testing out very soon i might have to place an order online because they don't have certain things available like the hair pomade that i want i can't find it at sephora and i don't think alta sells this brand so i might have to order some things and pick up in the store but yeah all right you guys that's the end of the haul i love you all thank you so much for watching and i hope to see you in the next one bye guys Thank you.